Hello, everyone, and thank you for tuning in to this episode. This is our newest, one of our newest shows here on Tiger Vision. Yes, this sir. is the, t uh, the TV show, which is short for the Tiger Vision show. Uh, I, I thought it was cool, you know, TV. You know, it's short for t Tiger Vision it. and television. Come on now. You know, it's, it's both a Tiger Vision show and a television Can't show. Can't be like, that. Yeah, I, th this brain, man. Wonderful. It's, it's brain. Genius over here. No, but uh, <laughs> this, is, this is the TV show, uh, our very first episode ever. Uh, I'm your host, Wyatt Street, and basically the way this show is going to work is every every episode I'll have a different Tiger Vision member on, have a little interview, play a little game or activity or something at the end of the show. So this week, I'd like everyone to give a warm welcome to the man, the myth, Stop. the legend, Stop. Mr. Thomas Stop. Marshall III. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Our live studio audience. Yeah, live studio audience, <laughs> it, which consists it. of like four people. Exactly. It's funny, though. Hey. It's a fun it's cool. show. It's cool. It's cool. Uh, but Thomas, you know, thank you for coming on the show. I appreciate it. Definitely. No, thank you for having me, man. Yeah. I'm honored to be the very first guest on the show. I love it. I really do. I'm honored to have you on as my first <laughs> my guest. Man. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. This this is what the TV show is all about, right here. <laughs> yeah. Love this. Uh, love but it. since it's the Tiger Vision show, let's let's start off by talking about well, Tiger Vision. Yes. So cool. I, I know you you know you're a sophomore like me, yep. and yep. you started last year like yeah, I did. We came in same time. Um, yeah. So like, how exactly did you get your start there? Like, what what, were, what was the chain of events like? For um, you? I I remember emailing Tiger Vision like the actual like email back in yeah. July because I knew I wanted to do TV. I wanted to do journalism. Like that was my goal after school. Be an ESPN reporter. I love sports. You know. Um, I applied for sports communications, didn't get in originally, oh. so I ended up doing English and minoring in sports communications, and I just like, that was my thing. So I was like, let me join a club that I can meet like-minded people like that. Yeah. So I said, let's join Tiger Vision. So I came on my RA at the time, Willie, Willie Webb. Willie Webb. Tiger Vision alum. Shout well, out I to Willie Webb. Alum. We haven't graduated yet. <laughs> yeah. so Tiger Vision, Willie Webb, he brought me along and said, hey, you would love to be on this, you know, because I... Um, I'm an English major too, so right. let's kind of bring you on. And I came out to the um, viewing of Extra Point, and I remember Zach Clark, another guy. Shout he, out to Zach Clark. Zach Clark, <laughs> he was just sitting here. He said, Thomas, come take my spot. Come on. And that panel was with Matthew, Josh, um, me, and Willie, and we just like kind of had our first yeah. Extra Point episode. And I was a freshman, didn't know anything, but it was the best time. It really was so, so much fun. Yeah, that, I mean, that's not too far off from mine, you know. Uh, I found out about Tiger Vision at Tiger Prowl. Yeah, I yeah, saw yeah, I saw I saw it at Tiger Prowl, and I was like, "This sounds awesome!" Right. So I came out and just fell in love with it, you know. And then, Ever like like you said, the extra point we do we're doing that together. Love it. Love it's, it. It's 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 wild. Oh, um, too wild. Too wild. Extra point is. Uh, <laughs> but no, it was funny because because we had that English class together freshman yeah, year. Yeah, freshman year. I mean, the very first the class very first class of our college careers we had together. Yeah, which is crazy. Which I find to be so awesome because I didn't is. like I didn't know you at first. Same, I just, same. Like I, I just I saw you at Tiger Vision one day, and then I saw you in class, and I was yeah. like, "Wait a minute, and then that yeah, guy I, looks exactly, familiar." I put two and two together. And you were wearing, like, and you were even wearing the Tiger Vision shirt one day in class, and I was yeah, like, "Hold yeah. on, who is this guy?" I Tiger Vision <laughs> member, and then I was, I was like, like, "Hey, White Street." And and and, then, then, and, 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 and and if I had known now, like just how things would have gone, that would have exactly. been so crazy. That is so crazy. Like, how we if I had known same classes, you know. Yeah. Man, that, that class was fun, though. It was. I, I want to go back to that class. We have to. Guys, I don't know if y'all understand this class. This class. <sighs> it's English 1030. Grad student taught the class. She said, hey, it's my first time ever teaching. And it was 8 a.m. You teaching. could tell she didn't want to be there nope. any more than we did. Exactly. <laughs> so we come in. Every day we got out in a matter of within 20, 30 minutes. Keep in mind, this is supposed to be 50-minute exactly. class. 50-minute class, like a matter of 20, 30 minutes almost every time. Literally like, the very first class I attend in college, exactly. and I'm coming and I'm intimidated. Like, exactly oh my same. god, this is college. It's Gotta gonna be intense. Out. It's exactly. real stuff, you know. And, and and we go over the syllabus and everything at, in 20 minutes. Yep. Very first class ever in college. We're done. Yep. And she's like, all right, we're done. You can right, go now. And, and we're like, all just looking around at each other. The class like, really didn't know what to do. Yeah, because <laughs> we're all in the same boat here. We're all looking at each other like, wait, is she serious? Like, exactly. is this is this right. it? And eventually, after a minute or so, someone bit the bullet and left, and exactly. we all just we're like, like, okay, let's get, let's go. It was. So that's how my college career exactly. started. That's us. That is how our college career started. It was great though. Fun yeah, and then it's been all downhill from since. Exactly. Um, yeah. yeah, but it's been fun. Uh, extra point. It's been great. Oh, it's been so much. It's been fun. great. Like we're, we're, we're rolling. Just starting off the extra point and being able to like we're now like kind of the featured panels because before yeah. like there was kind of this core panel that had it and we were like had to earn our stripes, you mm -hmm. know. And, and but now being a featured panel is so great. And like I'm I'm like now the host. Exactly. You know, and I remember like. 
I came in and I started, and Horace was the host. Yeah. Shout out to Horace. Oh, yeah, Horace Priester, um, great Horace guy. Horace Priester, great guy. guy. Yeah, but he was the guy, and I'm thinking, you know, okay, I'm going to have to, like, make my way onto the panel somehow. I'm yeah. probably not going to get much screen time my first year. Mm -hmm. And then within a month, I, I have taken over as the host because Horace had other things going on, and I hosted one time. That was mm -hmm. my first show, you know, I came on as host, and then all of a sudden, here I am. I'm, I, I, I had the torch passed to me, metaphorically speaking, instead of a microphone. Exactly. <laughs> but, you know, and that was just... I never expected that to happen, yeah. and it's just been—it's been crazy. It is. It yeah. gives you so much experience, and that's what I love about Tiger Vision. A lot of people just don't know, like for us that like want to do this after career or yeah. like be in the industry, kind of like this, like whether that be sports, whether that be TV or news or anything. We get so much experience every week, and to, like uh, to do this, you know, we're, we're not. It's not perfect. It's not exactly. as if you were like yeah. working for like an actual news right. station it's or, not anything, ABC but or anything. Like that. Yeah, but I mean, this is probably about as close as you can get it without is. actually working at a at a station like exactly. that. Exactly. You know, a real legit station, right. and the experiences I've had here, the things I've learned, mm -hmm. like it's gonna go a long way for me in the yeah, future, same, moving same. forward. So it's crazy. It is because I never got this opportunity in high school. Like no. my high school didn't have no. any like film I, stuff or any nothing we, like this. My my high school we had a we had a show but it was we had like a news show yeah. but it was it was bad. Same. We just had honestly like a new, yeah. honestly the, the 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 one I did for my middle school mm -hmm. was run much better. Wow. Which, that's, that, that's, how yeah, that's how crazy it was. That's um, how mine was too. They just filmed yeah. like on the iPhone. Like they didn't care about. Oh it. well, that's even worse yeah. than it, my yeah, school. Yeah, it was filmed on an iPhone. <laughs> like they did not care. But like just Goodness. look at us now, how we're able to come yeah. something like that. It's really I mean, cool. and this is legit stuff. Oh yes, sir. And speaking yes, sir. of legit stuff, Mister, you uh, you came up with a great idea. Last spring, uh, Tiger Town Countdown. Could you tell us about that? My goodness. All right. Last spring, <laughs> I remember I was talking on the phone with my dad. That's how it all started. Yeah. I said, Dad, I want to, I'm on this club, Tiger Vision, Studio on TV Network. I want to do college game day, but for us. I want to bring it here every single week and, like, have a really cool thing like that. Yeah. And he's like, oh, that's a great idea. Just do it. And I'm like, I have no idea even <laughs> how to comprehend to even do anything yeah. like that. So I got everyone in the room together one night, and it was like in April, and I said, guys, this is my idea. Do you believe in it? Like, will you just join me on this quest to end up it working out? And everyone, every single person bought into it. And without a doubt, the, the show couldn't have been done without everyone buying into oh, it. Oh, yeah, and everyone for sure. just like, like loving it and caring about it and putting as much time as I did because it was so many countless, countless hours waiting on phone calls, emailing like 60 people yeah. <laughs> but it just some just worked out it yeah really and i gotta say like, that morning that we did that first episode that was such a fun experience it was. you know because you watch game day and you you dream of being a part of it and yep. then we kind of got a taste of it exactly we, we kind of got we, as close as we could exactly, to as it close as we could. and and it was just such a wonderful amazing experience all three that we did yeah it really I mean, was, it really I, was. I, you know when i look back on my times here at clemson and specifically with tiger vision yeah. i'm gonna think back to those exactly to those tiger I, town countdown never, episodes never we did like putting that on my resume i just updated i said creator of tiger town got down i was like yeah that's pretty amazing like to start a show and to have it like that. And it was on the news, and mm -hmm. we had the news people come out. Yeah, we were on the news, like, y'all. on the news. Like, <laughs> the news, the, the actual the news. The actual news. Like, it was... It was it was crazy. It was amazing. It was amazing, to say the least. And I enjoyed every second of it. And uh, speaking of new shows, just filmed before us. Just, just, just filmed finished. before us. Same outfit. You, you, Same outfit. Yeah, yeah. So if, if you ever see this outfit on, on a show that airs at any point before this, that, yeah. that's probably why. Yeah, um, that's, why. that's why. Highlight. Yes, the, yes. Another one of Tiger Vision's newest shows. Yes, yes. Te technically slightly older than this one. Yeah, slightly uh, just a little. Just, just by a few minutes. <laughs> We're like twins. Minutes. We're like twins, <laughs> uh, these shows. You, you and Jay Black started the new show. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, yeah. We'll, Highlight. I know it's like a sports adjacent. Yeah, Is that yeah. how y'all y'all are describing yeah, it's it? It's sports adjacent, sports culture. We yeah. kind of don't want to talk about so much like the action on the field and stuff, but kind of what happens like with like um, behind the scenes, right? Like, like either like whether that's fashion, whether that's a little bit of everything. Like we just want to encompass what's all about, you know, the kind of sports, what makes sports other than just the play on the field. So it's not so much about what this player did on the court exactly. or which exactly. team beat this team or by how much. It's more about like the post game interview exactly. or exactly. like the Russell Westbrook outfit of the day exactly. or something like exactly. that. That's literally what yeah. we try to strive for. Jay Black just hit me up and said, Thomas, I got an idea. You know, like, let's do this. And I said, like, man, like, let's go for it. So yeah. we've been working, like, all over the break on it and stuff like that. Shout out to him for the logo and all that stuff. Really great, awesome job. 
and it just kind of worked out. And yeah. we're gonna have guests every week, so it's gonna be such a fun time, really fun. Yeah, to do. I mean, I, I know I personally love it because oh, you, you're kind of bridging that. Guy. It's it's like the best of both worlds. Yeah. You're getting you're mm-hmm. getting sports content. You're getting like Some pop culture, entertainment yeah, it's comment exactly. content. It's a little bit it's, of both. You're kind of like bringing these two things together. Mm-hmm. In, in a way that they work, yeah. and I think that that's really cool. So oh, I, I love it. I, I envision success for mm-hmm. you guys in the future. Oh yeah, definitely. So I I, I'm I'm excited to see. Check that show out. It airs Mondays, Mondays at nine. Mondays at nine. Mondays Check at nine. Out. Check it out, y'all. Um, and now we're gonna talk about a couple other things. Uh, you're you you're still in the Senate, right? Yes, I you're am. Still a student I, senator. Yes, last yeah. um year around this time, I ran for undergraduate student senate. I said I want to like make a change on campus, try to help people out, try to get some things going for people, and it's been one of the best experiences of my life. I love being in that senate room, just conveying my message, being able to have a platform to talk about issues yeah. that I really care about, and just really trying to propel Clemson better, to propel Clemson forward and just really work for the students. That's what I'm all about. I'm always like, let me handle things like, um, just little things like having our shows play in the dining hall, stuff right. like that. Like, I really want to like work for the people. And it's been a great ride. I really love seeing it so far. And I, I remember when you were campaigning for it, and I was seeing how much work and time and effort yeah. you were putting in yeah. this, and I was like, if this man doesn't win and get in the Senate, <laughs> I, heads are gonna roll. It'll be crazy. It'll be ridiculous. I think you would have had the entirety of Tiger Vision mobbing in your honor. I think so. I think um, so. I think cause, so. Because because <laughs> that would have been a travesty, honestly. It, was. it really would. But you know, we're we're all proud of you, man. You're doing great Appreciate stuff. You, you're gonna you're gonna keep up with Senate. Thank you. You're, you're gonna keep um, stick to that's it. That's why I don't future? know. I will be on student government. I'm not yeah. sure if I'll do Senate, but that I may be like a judicial position, a cabinet position. But I am. I'm still interested in Senate, so right. I just may end up running again. So I just don't know yet wherever the path leads me. That's where I'll go. Well, whatever this man does, if you have the opportunity to vote for him, vote for him. Appreciate it. He's going to be you. great. Thank you. You, you, ever, you. you thinking about ever running for, for class president at any point? I don't know. No? Maybe? It's, it's a little early talk. Well, yeah. We, so yeah. There's been some thoughts. I don't, I'll say yeah, that. Yeah. Okay. Thoughts. All right. I got you. Everyone always talks about it. It's like, oh, you should do it, Tom. But we'll to, I mean, to, to be fair, it's not a bad idea, Mr. Future President of I the United say, States. Exactly. Yeah. Um, don't, little did you know we had a little president, yeah. vice president thing going. 2042. Don't forget to vote Marshall Street. Marshall Street. That's us. Please. Please. On, on the road to a better tomorrow mm. today. Thank you. Thank you. Love that. Yes. So... Thomas, you're yes. also an RA here. Yes, I am. I am. A, I, what, do too, what, I do too many things. This man, I don't know how he gets sleep. I don't. I was up at three don't. o'clock. I woke up at <laughs> seven this morning. I got four hours, and that's it. And I'm still kind I'm of surprised you got this. four. Yeah, exactly. I'm surprised I got four. Yes, I'm an RA in the Manning Malden community. Yeah. So I, I'm an RA. It's the only um, floor of uh, Malden. It's the only uh, only floor of Malden. Only guy. The only. Yeah. Only there we go. <laughs> that's how you. That's how you speak. It's one floor building. English major. I don't know how to talk. But yeah, the only floor guys, and it's been really fun working with them, just seeing them grow as kids. Like they literally like coming in freshmen, don't know what to expect at all. Yeah. And now they're just like boom, like they are in, in clubs and they go to FCA. And some people want to be involved in student government. Like, yeah. I I love being an RA. It's such a rewarding process to see kids go. It really is. And what was that process like for you? Like how arduous of a application process was that? Um, it was not. It, it was not that bad. It just kind of like continued on from like just applying, seeing really why I want to be an RA, mm-hmm. um, going through the interview, which was great, and then having a class, which was leadership, right. to really hone in on my leadership skills so I could really convey like what it is to be there for someone. And that class helped me out so much. It really did. Yeah. I mean, I, don't know, I haven't had you as my RA. I think that would be really cool. It would be great. I, 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 I wish, oh. I wish you were in whole, um, exactly. McCabe next year. I know. That I wish you were in McCabe because be I'm, I'm, I'm going to be, be in McCabe. Oh, man. No, so much fun. Uh, you know, I thought about that one day, and I was like, you know what? It'd be so cool if Thomas were my really RA. It really would. It really Because that would be so yeah. much fun. But I am. Some of my friends, I'm going to be the Call Me Mr. RA. So all of the Call Me Mr. Oh, cool. program. So it's for black um, guys that are education majors, which is really cool. And so I'm going to be over them. So a couple of my friends are already misters. So yeah. I'm kind of going to be friends with them. So it's going to be kind of fun. So nice. I'm excited to be in Calvin Court next year. That'd be cool. For sure. You got any other big plans lined up for this semester next year coming up That's what I'm uh, to with figure. Tiger Vision um, or anything else? I do. So I am a intern at um, the Paw Journey over in the football facility. Yeah. So going to be doing some stuff with that and maybe seeing me write some thank you note videos, you know? Yeah. Never know. I got to say, those <laughs> are amazing. I appreciate it. The, the, the first Thanks. one I saw and I was like, my man with the... <laughs> well, what was the inspiration for that? Did they tell you to do that, or was it that just like, I, was that a creative choice? It's from Jimmy Fallon. I'm gonna, yeah. I copy, I copy from this man. He you, always <laughs> with the hesitation when he yeah. does that, and I'm like, I just want to add a little dramatic effect. 
That's we're we're, we're going to take it and add 10 to it. 10 to it. And that's I, what I did. That's what I, I got to say, though, that was the... The, every time you did that, that was the best part of the video. Thank you. Honestly. I appreciate it. I have so many people said that. So many people said that. <laughs> I love that you did it so well. Thank you. Thank um, but that's going to conclude the interview portion. Oh yes, I'm yes. ready for. Ready for the next portion. We got some. Uh, we got some fun stuff for you. It yes. wouldn't be. It wouldn't be a fun interview show without us embarrassing ourselves for not. you. So, uh, for you, we're going to be playing some Clemson trivia. Bean boozled. So mm. let me go ahead and get those. All up. right. I love it. I love it, guys. We got some questions that we're about to have. Yes. We got, got a, a get a spit cup in case some of these get real bad. So you know? just just in case you don't know how this is going to work, um, we each have prepared uh, oh. five multiple choice questions mm -hmm. about Clemson trivia. Mm -hmm. Anything, anything at all. And the way it's going to work is we'll take turns posing our questions to the other. If you answer a question correctly, the person who asked the question has to spin the wheel and eat a bean. Whoever, and if you uh, answer incorrectly, you have to do it. And I'm so, I'm so these beans. They uh, could either be good flavors or bad, or bad flavors, flavors. I mean, and we're hoping we that we grab... We have spoiled milk on here, rotten eggs. There's, egg, there's like, vomit. Like crazy. Um, see, some of these? See, see, some of these aren't that bad. They're like toothpaste and lawn clippings. not that bad. Toothpaste lawn clippings, believe it or not, are actually pretty darn We've good. All I would eat. Before. I would eat those all day long. Right, right. So um, you have done this before, right? I have done this before. Okay. It's fun. It's stressful as hell, but it's fun. It's all right. So done. we're going to play this. Like I said, it's, uh, spit, spit cup, cup in case you need it. I might. I would recommend we try to swallow if we can, just for oh, yes. the entertainment. It will be more fun. Um, be more fun. But if we can't, if we absolutely cannot get it down because okay. I don't expect you to get vomit down. I may, I may do it. Um, we'll see. I b I have before. It's not fun. Not fun. Um, not excuse fun. me. Barf. Barf. Ooh. Um. Okay. But okay. we got the spit cup. I've got my. Uh, I've got my. You can't really see it. It's it's Tr green. Trust these sprite. My, uh, my sprite. <laughs> um, I'm, I mean, I mean, green cocoa. Screen, I mean, I mean my carbonated lemon lime carbonated beverage. Drink. Um. Not Sierra Mist. <laughs> Screw Sierra Mist. Exactly. That's beside the point. It's terrible. Um, it's terrible. And I propose a little. We. I, I propose this also to keep things fun and interesting. We each have a lifeline, mm -hmm. where mm. at any point you only get one though. But at any point you can use it on a question. Strike out two incorrect answers, leaving you with two answers. So you have a 50/50 shot of getting it right. Okay. However, there are now two beans on the table. Ooh. Okay. So it doubles the stakes. I love that. By love getting that. you half the answers. All so. Right. I'll. Uh, get let's get started, yeah. man. I'm ready. I'll, I'll go ahead and start us off the mm. first one. Mm. Um, which of these names was the first name of Clemson University? And as you know, Clemson uh, opening back in 1889. Yes, yes. Uh, did we start off as A, Clemson Military College, B, Upstate University, C, Clemson A&M, or D, Clemson Agricultural College? Um, I'm going to go with A, the military one. Sorry, no, it was Clemson Agricultural College. Oh, that was my second choice. Oh, Dang. gotta Dang. get that bean. So I gotta spin it? Spin right, it. I spin it. And. Oh, you got off lucky. Toothpaste. Berry, so tooth, berry, berry blue, blue or, or toothpaste. toothpaste. This is very. This looks like that. All right, so this is. Either blue. way, you win. Either way. That's toothpaste. That's toothpaste. Yeah. That's not bad. It's not that bad, though. That tastes pretty good. Yeah. Toothpaste, I'm all right with. Mmm. Yeah. That is really good, actually. Mmm. Yeah. Toothpaste. I'm down with that. See, see. I like that. See, I like that. This man getting off easy on the hey. first one. All right. Got a question for you. All right, hit me. Um. Okay. I got. I got. I got an easy one for you. All right. All right. I like it. Start off easy and work our what way up. What is running down the hill in Clemson? Oh is man, you're making this too easy. A. A last day class tradition when students run from the campus. B. A football tradition where the Tigers run to the field. Or C. A final tradition where students streak on campus. I think I'm gonna go with B, the football one. Follow B. Okay, yeah. you got it. You got it. Thomas, so you made this too easy for I'm yourself. I'm gonna get some hard ones. You, you're, you're gonna have to eat a bean again. Oh dang it! So, oh hold on, let me, let me get a good spin. Yeah, good spins, good spins only. Ooh, coconut or spoiled milk? Is that what that's called? Uh, we'll say we'll say caramel, caramel corn, corn or, or moldy, moldy cheese. cheese. Jesus, he's setting me up, everyone. He's mm. setting me up. I don't Which know. Which one is that? Which one is that? Um, looks like that? this one, maybe? Yeah. Let's go with this. So I this think that one's the one. Moldy cheese or... Oof. Sport or moldy Ooh. cheese. Ooh. Ah. Caramel corn. Please be caramel corn. Oh. Oh, oh. it's all the cheese. Oh. 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 Whoa. Oh, whoa. oh no. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, man. Mm. <laughs> God dang! 
Do you need the cup? No, I'm good. I'm you good. good? You good? I can. Like, it's in my throat. It's in my throat. The worst part is the aftertaste, honestly, because it doesn't go away. <laughs> mm. Ah, that's terrible. That's the worst. Man, that's I'm the worst. I, I, I partially hope for your sake you get this one right, but I don't want to eat any of these. Yeah. I so. Hope, yeah, yeah. God, my all right. God. Uh, number mm. two question. Here we go. Mm. In what year did Clemson win its first national title in any sport? Mm. Okay. Any sport. A. 1936. <laughs> B, 1890, C, 1981, or D, 1974? I need him again. <laughs> you got to read him again. Okay. I, I'm okay. still yeah, on yeah, the yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. 1936, 1890, 1981, or 1974? I'm going to go with 1890. 1981. Oh! <laughs> 1981. Was that the first one? National championship yeah. in anything? In any sport. The first, any sport. the first championship we won in any sport was that first football championship. And since then, we've won in 84 and 87 in men's soccer, 2003 in men's golf, mm. and 2016 in football. Yeah. No yeah. women's national titles as of yet. Dang. Come on, b-ball team, volleyball. Yeah, come on, guys. Shout out to Mueller, who does the volleyball vlogs. Hey. <laughs> Dang, um, Thomas, I'm feeling bad for you now. This is terrible, y'all. Buttered rotten egg or buttered popcorn? Ooh. I could eat a rotten egg on this show. Like, why? this is, which one is this? It's this one. Yeah. Butter popcorn. Yeah. I see. I can't even. I like smelling. It does nothing. <laughs> Rotten egg or butter popcorn. All right. <laughs> oh God. Dang. <laughs> ah, this is bad. Mmm. Mmm. Come on, Thomas. Oh. Oh, it's like t like I, it's the egg like it's literally a spoiled egg. Mm. Oh, oh, this that's is bad. That's bad. You need to start coming out with some, I with got some harder I questions got on me. Right. Come on, man. I got you some good ones. All right. All right. All right. All right. Hit me. <laughs> which which season? This is bad. Oh, this rot that rot that rot day. <laughs> I can still feel it. Um, Oof. Which season was Davos Sweeney's first as Clemson's head coach? Twenty mm. ten. 2009, 2011, or 2007? I want to say 2009. You're correct. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Is, <laughs> <laughs> I did not envision this going so well for me. I I'll be done, honest with I'm you. I'm done with this show right now. <laughs> I am, I'm done. I'm another one. Peach or barf? <sighs> That one's honestly the worst. People, this is my demise, everybody. <laughs> um, I just want to thank my mom. I, I feel like I, I feel so bad. Mom, I love you. Um, <laughs> P.O.P. Hold it down. Um, Tommy, is this it? Is this it? Um, I think it's this one. Okay. Hopefully you put down a good one. I think you put down a good one. I'm rooting for you. It's Peach. It's Peach. Hey. Yes. Getting Praise. off lucky on this Praise one. God, there we everybody. go. It's Peach. All right, Thomas. Mm, wait. Here we go. I had a little bit of both in it, maybe. Ooh. I don't even know. Ooh. Yeah, I think it's Peach. It's Peach. I have a headache. I feel like right you. I, no, I'm pretty sure you would know what if it's the barf because that one is <laughs> terrible. Yeah. It almost made me barf one time. Mm. Um. So here we go. Next one. Mm -hmm. In which year did Clemson players first rub Howard's Rock? Okay. Was it A 1960? Mm -hmm. B, 1966, mm -hmm. C, 1967, or D, 1970? 1970. It's 1966. Oh, my gosh. I'm Thomas. I don't know Clemson. I you, don't know you anything You might need to start Clemson. thinking about this lifeline sometime a, soon. I do. I'm a South Carolina fan, apparently, the way I'm talking. Oh, come on, man. Um, so, spoiled milk or coconut? Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. Okay, that's not that bad. That shouldn't be too bad. Come on. Coconut. Coconut. That's pretty really good. That's really right. good. Yeah. Mm. There you it's go. Really good. Jelly Belly. You did a good job with that coconut for me. I like that. I like that one. Mm. I feel like they should just, like sell these separately. For sure. I think so. Okay. Which Clemson football head coach has the most wins with 165? Hmm. Tommy Bowden? Dabo Sweeney? Frank Howard or Danny Ford? Um, I'm torn between Ford and Howard. Because 
It was. I know. I'm pretty sure it's not Tommy, and I don't think Dabo has been here long enough. Mm, I'm gonna go with Frank Howard. Frank Howard? You are correct. Oh, God, dang. I, my, we're not friends after this. <laughs> I don't think we are. I don't think we are. Ooh, that, that's an easy one. This next one. I'd like to apologize to all the Tiger fans out there for witnessing this okay, murder. Okay. Okay. Um, Barry Blue or Toothpaste? Okay. Yeah, that, like, that, that that's not bad. Good. That's not bad. Either way, you win. I think it's time to look up harder questions, Thomas. I should. I think it's toothpaste. I'm looking up harder questions, like, and tough ones, because this is this is crazy. Okay, that was good. Toothpaste was awesome. Yeah, good. yeah. Okay. Hopefully, this one goes better for you. Don't forget, you do have that lifeline still. I I, I think I'm gonna use. It gives you a 50/50 chance, and I may have to eat two beans. Mm. So, which sport did Clemson discontinue in 1995? Was 1995? it 1995? 1995. Was it A, wrestling, B, women's fencing, C, men's fencing, or D, boxing? 1995. 1995. Which sport do you think stuck around the longest? Um, say, the question, say the ones again. What wrestling, else? women's fencing, men's fencing, or boxing? And they were discontinued in 1995. Which one was discontinued in 1995? You, you still got the lifeline if you Men's need it. Fencing. Um, I'm going to say me, uh, wrestling? Wrestling? Is it wrestling? It is wrestling. Yes. Thank you. Ooh. Eat a bean. Eat a bean, <laughs> Wyatt. Come on. Oh, I broke it. Oh, no. Oh, no. We need another one. <laughs> All right. Okay. Alrighty. We fixed it. We fixed it. What is it? Oh, chocolate pudding or, or canned dog food. Yes, 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 yes. In this van right now. I've had this one coming. I've gone through long. I have had this one I've coming. I've gone through so. too much. <sighs> canned dog food, canned dog food. Please. <laughs> oh, God. Yes, yes. Yeah. The people have spoken. I love it. I love it. Yes. It's all right, buddy. It's going to be okay. It's gonna be all right. Dog food's good for you, you know? It's, it's good. Nice. Take it Down like the hatch. Champ. Take it like a champ, all right? Yeah. Questions? How many questions we got left? Uh, you'll have two more. I have two one. Two more. Two more, all right? Kelly Bryant's older cousin is who? Is a, is a, is a tough one. Oh, really? Who is Kelly Bryant's older cousin? Mm -mm. Oh, I, I, get, I get no uh, intro choices? Oh, yeah, you should get Yeah, the yeah, come on, come on, man, come on. I, I think I know Bryant, the answer already. Davis Bryant, DeAndre Hopkins, Taj Boyd, or Mike Williams? Mr. Mr. Martavis Bryant. Martavis Bryant? I mean. Well, what? Yeah, yeah you're, you're correct, man. You're correct. I, I mean, I, I, I could have said that without the answer choices, I, but I wanted to see what you came up with. Yeah, I'm not shot. Here I am, spinning <laughs> another one. Here we go. I feel bad. Here we go, here we go. Moldy cheese or caramel corn? Again. <sighs> again. 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 Which one are those again? Uh, here it is. Yeah. These were bad. Th th this was a bad one, too. Yeah, that one. Oh, Jesus Christ. Don't worry. I still got the oh, aftertaste. Oh, God. That's the worst one. <laughs> that's, the wor that's legit the worst one. Like, forget them all. God dang. <laughs> It's like it's like you get cheese from it, but it's like a sock in your mouth. Like, <laughs> God, <laughs> I'm gonna curse. My goodness, this is bad. It's okay. It's we'll we'll bleep it in post. <laughs> oh. We can bleep it in oh. post if you have to. Oh, that's, um, that's terrible. Ugh. Are you are you ready for for the next one? Yes. Let's, okay. let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's go. When was Tiger Vision founded? Oh shit. 1990, 1994. 2000 or 2002. God damn. If I don't get this, um, do you, um, you still John, have your, you still have your lifeline, I so do. I would recommend using it since it's the last one. Last one. Let's go for it. Use that lifeline. Okay. Take away two ends. Taking away A and D, so it's not 90 or 02. Ooh. So it's either 1994 or the year 2000. Mm. Well, the Jonas brother said he went to the year um, 3000. 3, so 
that couch potato thing. Um, I don't think it does. I don't think it does at all. No. If I don't get this, um, please fire me, Jackie Alexander and Josh. Take away all my credentials. From try, this try, try, try and think around. Try and think about when, when, when Tiger Vision might have been added. You yeah. know, just, yeah. just. <laughs> <laughs> Josh made a funny joke, everyone. Um, um, gosh, 1994, my sister's birth year. You're correct. We started this Clemson Cable Network, by the way, in case you were wondering. CCN? CCN? And then, and then we became Clemson Television, and now we're Tiger CTV, Vision. CTV, now we're Tiger Vision. Yeah. I like this. I like Tiger Vision. So. I have a headache from this. Like, my, like <laughs> my, I'm about to explode from this. I don't oh, even know what's God. going on. Peach or barf? Yes. Yes. Barf. 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 Start the barf chants, everyone. Barf. 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 Wait, barf. which one is it? Um... Cause this, there's also the, that one. It's this one then. It's, it's this one. I feel like it's that color. Yeah. Barf, 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 barf. It's peach. It's peach. It's peach. It's peach. Uh, oh, that's all right. It's all right. It's pretty good. For no barf. Pretty I, good. I bet that'll be pretty bad. All right. I speak from experience. The uh, barf one is awful. I bet. I bet. All right. We got some. Ooh, I gotta pick a good one. Oh wait, you did the lifeline. I have to do two. Ooh, you did. You did. Oh yes, yes. You have to do two. Forgot. Why well, I pick another one? Juicy pear or booger? Ooh. There it goes. Juicy pear or booger? Juicy pear. Wow. I got up lucky. Holy crap. I'm getting off with these, man. These were terrible. Um, I'm about to I don't know how this is happening. Taylor's sitting over here in awe. Exactly. I'm, 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 this is just terrible. To be fair, I am too. This was set up for me to lose, you know. Hey, I'm just proud of us. We yeah. haven't needed the spit cup yet. Thomas, I want you to make this as hard as possible. Okay. Especially considering I'm going to lifeline us. This is, this is not a hard one, everyone. Uh, no, Thomas, no. I want this to be hard. No, let's just go with it. Let's just go with it. This is the, this is the easiest thing. Thank you to Fan Chest, everyone, for giving <laughs> me these easy behind questions. Which of the following did not attend Clemson University? A. Brian Dawkins, B. Sammy Watkins, C. Antonio Brown, or D. C. J. Spiller? <laughs> <laughs> say it. Say it. Go ahead and say it. <laughs> I'm gonna lifeline it. Put two beans out there, right. and it's gonna be uh, Mr. Antonio, Antonio Brown. Antonio Brown. Central Michigan Chippewa, everyone. His oh yeah. Back was Dan Lefevre. Great. Wow. Great. Great. I know my trivia for Central Michigan. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, right. I'll tell you what, Thomas. You take one bean, I'll take the other. Let's do it. All right, tutti frutti or stinky socks? That doesn't sound too bad. All right. I'll, I'll do this for you. Thank you. I I'll do this one for you because I, 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 I literally feel bad because I didn't expect I, this to go so I poorly. I didn't expect it to go All either, right, you peach know? or barf? Peach or barf. Peach or cool. barf. So. Same time, we got to cheers it. Got to cheers it. Um, this is it. No, that's not it. No, that's not it. Nope. This one? Right? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. All right? Yeah. Cheers, buddy. Here we go. Down the hatch. Tutti Frutti. Yeah! <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Barf, barf, barf. <laughs> yes. Thanks to that Sprite. Mmm, tastes like bubble gum. Real nice. Yeah, Tutti Frutti's great. This is great. I love this. Just for, just for fun, I want a yeah. long clipping. Mmm, long clipping? For sure. You got any more berry blues? Those were good. Like, even whether it was toothpaste or not, I love those. Yeah, they always skimp on the berry blues. They do, because they know it's good. They know it's yeah, good. they know it's good. See, I got long clippings. It doesn't really have a taste. Not bad. Not bad. Like, it's really not that bad. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to do any more because I feel like I'm going to pass out in a couple seconds. Yeah, you've done enough. So, thank you. Um, <laughs> I'm going to die. That's it. You've done enough. <laughs> um, that is it. Yeah, you know, Thomas, I'm sorry that I tortured you. No, this was fun. This was so much fun. I literally didn't expect this to go so poorly I for you. I didn't either. Um, I'm going to prepare better trivia questions we're gonna next have to, time. Next time you come on, we'll do this again. Yes. And, um... Redemption. Come, 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 come in with better questions. Come in with better questions. Come and, on. um, yeah. That's it. But I got to say, it was fun. Thank you, Thomas, my man. once again, thank it's you for coming on so the much. show. Thank I, you. Thank you. I had a blast. Uh, yes, yes. I'd like to think this was a good, successful first show. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Uh, so, Thomas, if you want to see more of Mr. Thomas here, yep. be sure to catch out Highlight. Mondays Highlight. at 9. Yep. The Extra Point. Extra Point. Uh, Wednesday's at uh, 8.30. 8.30. And, uh... You don't do any other That's shows. That's it. Do I, don't, no, I don't. Not yet. Follow, not yeah, yet. Follow me on um, the gram. Yes. Marshall underscore Thomas three I because my name is Thomas Marshall the third. The third. Hit me up. Hit it. Hit me up. Yeah. And uh, 
that's it. That's all we've got for you for the very first episode of the TV show. So thank you for tuning in. I'm Wyatt Street. This was Thomas Marshall III. We'll catch you next time with a new guest and new games to play. See ya. See ya.